National Sleep Foundation, Wikipedia article audio. The National Sleep Foundation is a U.S. nonprofit organization that promotes public understanding of sleep and sleep disorders. It engages in various activities to advance its purpose and goals, including the operation of several websites and the sponsorship of research. Though the foundation denies endorsing commercial products, some sellers have claimed that their products have some sort of official status with it. Purpose Activities Finances Controversies Founded in 1990, the nonprofit National Sleep Foundation promotes public understanding of sleep and sleep disorders. It seeks to improve public health and safety by supporting sleep-related education, research, and advocacy. The Foundation's goals are increased understanding of the importance of sleep to good health and productivity, prevention and slash or remediation of health and safety problems related to insufficient sleep and untreated sleep disorders, expanded scientific research in sleep and sleep medicine, and implementation of public policy that promotes sleep education, research, and treatment. The Foundation is based in Arlington, Virginia. The Foundation engages in various activities to advance its purpose and goals. Many of these are described on its website. To help reduce the incidents and consequences of sleep-deprived driving, it sponsors Drowsy Driving Prevention Week and maintains a Drowsy Driving website. To inform the public about the positive benefits of sleep health, it operates a sleep health website, covering sleep science, bedroom design, lifestyle, and the effect of age on sleep requirements. Its promotional activities have been occasionally covered by national news media. Research sponsored by the National Sleep Foundation has been published in Journal of the American Academy of Sleep Medicine and its educational conferences have been provisionally accredited for continuing medical education credits by the Accreditation Council for Continuing Medical Education. The Foundation's programs are funded by corporate and individual contributions, and through its partnerships with corporations and government entities. Its recent revenues are in the $3.5 million range and its recent assets are about $5 million. Contributions are tax-deductible. According to then-CEO Richard Jellula, the largest single source of National Sleep Foundation funding is pharmaceutical and medical device companies. In particular, Nearly $1 million of its $3.6 million budget at the time came from manufacturers of sleeping medications. The NSF has been criticized by the American Institute of Philanthropy, Dr. Sidney M. Wolfe of Public Citizen S. Health Research Group, Jerry Avorn, and other consumer and medical ethics groups for its reliance on industry funding, and the possible influence of such funding on its work. In 2005, for instance, they released a survey purporting to find extremely high rates of insomnia, declared insomnia to be a crisis and an epidemic, announced an Insomnia Awareness Day and a National Sleep Awareness Week, but the poll, the declaration of a dedicated day and week, and the widely distributed press kits were paid for by manufacturers of sleeping medications and the public relations firm assigned to contact medical reporters about the poll took the opportunity to mention the shortly approaching release of Lunsta, the first sleeping medication approved in the United States for extended use. Simultaneously, the drug's manufacturer assigned 1,250 pharmaceutical sales representatives to educate physicians about Lunsta as part of a $60 million advertising push. 
A Sacramento Bee report on these connections also noted that 10 of NSF's 23-member board of directors had contemporary or past financial ties to manufacturers of sleeping medications. A previous 2002 Sleep in America poll from NSF, which similarly characterized the results as revealing an epidemic of daytime sleepiness in its press release, was similarly characterized in a report by the Seattle Times as industry astroturfing due to sponsorship from the makers of the sleeping medications Unisom, Sonata, and Ambien. Similarly, NSF also worked with pharmaceutical company Merck to launch what they characterized as a new educational program that highlights personal stories about sleep for four individuals from across the country. A report in the Huffington Post described this effort as part of a multi pronged unbranded marketing effort for Belsamra, Merck's then forthcoming new sleeping drug. Sepracor, manufacturer of Lunsta, also awarded a $300,000 grant to NSF for a series of sleep medicine alert brochures designed to raise awareness of insomnia amongst physicians. Though the foundation claims that it does not make commercial endorsements, some merchants and products have claimed to be endorsed by the National Sleep Foundation or have implied such endorsement in their literature. Notable among these is My Pillow which makes such claims in its very frequently run television ads. In 2016, MyPillow agreed to stop making this claim in California, and paid a large fine for this and other claims.